How you guys doing out there? I'm writing, making this video about my Ryobi jet fan blower. I got a, I got a um, letter. Sorry about that. I got a letter on March the second. It says here that you know there was a recall on it, and um, on the Ryobi um, eight amp electric jet fan blower model RY42102 and um, here it is right here and I called them today and they told me to package it I found them get a box here's the box I'm gonna send it to them oh, well no, I'm not gonna send it to a FedEx it's gonna pick it up uh, from home so the FedEx gonna pick it up um, the motor the uh, fan blew out last year sometime the end of the, coming to the end of the fall i was cleaning the yard and the, and the charts let me sit this down real quick right here i don't even see a hook shout out to all the the rods and driveway um i'm surprised no one ever i haven't heard anyone getting hurt by this but um they had a recall on it. i knew anything i knew that um Something like this happened. You gotta have a recall on the, on the merchandise, right? And sure enough, here it is. The letter right here. Put my address on here. From um, let me just see what's up. Put my address. Let me block that off. From from work One World Technology Inc. Um, so I'm putting it in the box now. What you hear right here? All the the motor, the little orange blade is in there right there. You can see it right there. The little orange blades are totally destroyed. I put it in the box now. Gave me a customer number. Put the customer number on the box. FedEx will pick it up the door uh, sometime this week. Um, and uh, maybe next week. I think it's next week. Um, so, there you have it. The recall. And I'm gonna send these charts back to them anyway. So, as I, said, I made a video before about it because I liked it. I liked the blower. It's a nice blower. Nice, inexpensive blower. Very affordable. But um, I'm shocked that they they sold it with such a cheap um, blade. Um, I don't understand that part. I don't know how they got past um, uh, what do you call uh, what do you call it? Um, oh wow, I can't remember the name. <laughs> you know, before they send stuff out, you know, people who checks it, make sure everything is working properly. I'm quite sure they had to put it through tests, right? Let it run for a while. But um, with my video cut off, that means, you know, that's the end of the video. But I'm going to go ahead, put this video up on YouTube. I see that no one else put one up yet about the recall, but it's in the box. I'm going to fold it up. Tape it and get it ready to sit out on the on the um, on the. I think they pick it up on the 16th. Um, see what happens. They to, told me to take the um, black tube and off. They didn't want that. They just want the housing. So I guess they're gonna repair it or send a new one out. Put a new blade on it. Probably repair it. Um, I hope the blade doesn't break like the other blade. I really. You know, who wants to sweep a lot of stuff up? You get a blower. Once you get a blower, you don't want to sweep no more. Just about yards. You don't. I'm serious. So you got a big yard. You got other houses. You know you might have. Uh, you might get cleaning for. Um, it's the cord version. It's not the. Right here is the cord version. I'm cool with that for right now, but. Um, but here it is. I'm sending it out to him. Thank you guys for watching the video. It's a recall, so you guys didn't get your letter. If you purchased this, make sure you get your letter. If not, you call them anyway. If you've been purchasing these um, blades, I was just I was sending it back to them anyway. One person on YouTube said they had bought like five. Got a replacement blades five times? No, no, no. Uh, don't do that. Just send it. Just get. Just make sure you get the recall. Call them and you send it in to them. Make sure you get the proper blade. I hope this blade is durable. The way things should be made. 
Okay, guys, thank you. Take care. Bye-bye.